Hey YouTube, this is Pamela, and this is Craft and Commentary, and what I have here is another one of my nice uh, journals. This one is a gift for my sister, and uh, it incorporates all the good stuff um, that I've been developing, and as folks know, I'm really new to all this crafting and art journaling and doing artwork at all. And I uh, only started not even a year ago. And I'm exploring and um, uh, my inspiration is Jenny Belly, so look that up. Uh, she had some videos that made me feel like maybe I could do this also. And uh, I've been having so much fun and uh, watching so many wonderful videos from all you out there and on journaling and on binding methods. And, of course, uh, as folks know, I have a cinch, uh, cinch binder, uh, spiral bound uh, unit that uh, I buy my spirals on eBay. This one is purple, which is kind of special. So, um, what I have, I've incorporated all the good stuff. Um, again, want to reiterate that I found uh, 150 or thereabout um, hanging file folders in the trash. And that became my sort of signature substrate that I use um, for painting. And then I learned how to make my own gesso, uh, a homemade gesso, which is joint compound, uh, Elmer's glue, uh, latex wall paint, and then the acrylic paints, the really more expensive acrylic paints for the pigment. And uh, this is uh, one of my latest um, creations, artwork. And uh, again, basically what I do is I throw down a, uh, I, I throw down a lot of paint and with the joint compound you get dimension. You get dimension and uh, I throw, I also um, don't mix the colors. I let them uh, stay unique and as well as possible I blotch on. And then I let it dry, and then I come back with a sort of um, misty, just a sort of a very heavy with uh, joint compound, and I make it very, uh, I put that all across, use a lot of water to, um, to dilute it, and I put that over, and then what I do is I wipe away with baby, um, a baby wipe or a cosmetic sponge. Cosmetic sponges I use a lot. This looks like I probably used a credit card. That was the original um, paint that I put down. And I, I love this kind of very, um, almost like it's marble um, and very kind of, as well as possible, sort of a natural kind of uh, organic uh, look. Okay, so um, I love the color. Pink is really nice, so uh, seem to have a lot of luck with pink. Okay, so um, so the, the other thing, which is, um, I've shown this in other videos, is that I have this thing for, um, for security paper. <laughs> so I just uh, bind in a bunch of security paper from, from envelopes that would otherwise be thrown away. And that's the whole idea that I advertise uh, the, what, what I would call, conspicuous repurposing. <laughs> I think I made up that term. So that's what I like, the conspicuous repurposing. So I cut these page, pages down, and uh, obviously some of these things are just, you know, kind of garbage, non-negotiable. <laughs> And uh, again, the insides, the security paper, some is better than others. And then some oddball pages sometimes. And then I use these, um, uh, these cup holders that we're all familiar with that you get at Starbucks. 
and um, these are things that you would normally throw away again. Everything here was something that you would normally throw away, but is repurposed. So actually all of this takes quite a bit of time to cut down these pieces of paper. And uh, then I use, I get these uh, snaps on eBay. You, see, you can see how it's held in like that. And then I have my own stamp art by Pamela Rice, and then I date it for posterity, haha. <laughs> and then uh, I use uh, this, the, um, what do you call that, the Big Bite, um, uh, uh, what, what do they call that again, for the, um, these are not grommets, but um, they're like grommets, and they hold in uh, a pen. Like I've said in other videos, I believe that all notebooks, and so few of them that you can buy at the store, have a built-in place for you to put a pen. And then I also painted the, the, the inside. So, um, then I used just, this is uh, black elastic. And to cover up on the other side, on the main side, as you can see on the back, here we have this kind of not so pretty thing. But um, so I made a point on the front of the notebook to glue on a square um, so that it covers up that on the front. And I took a little black um, magic marker or something and uh, outlined it. So it looks like a little buckle or something. So this is uh, a present for my sister, and uh, I can't wait to give it to her. I wanted to uh, document this one before it went out, <laughs> so I can always enjoy it too myself uh, off into the future. I hope she enjoys it. And uh, that's it. Thumbs up, uh, comment, uh, and uh, crafting commentary, and uh, subscribe, please. Uh, and uh, thank you for watching.